If it doesn't wobble, then it's gonna take off that way because of the way the ball is spinning, going off your axis, right? So if your axis is like 1130 or whatever, it's gonna take off that way. But if it's wobbly, it's not gonna take off because the wind's not gonna hit these in the right way. Yeah. You have movement of your feet and you have movement of your hands. There's no stall period, all one fluid motion. Rhythmic movements promote timing of the hand in correlation to where the front foot is coming down. That could be another piece that we add into your actual stretch mechanics. When you lift your leg, your hands gotta move and we need movement. Yeah, you're just stacked here and there's no initial move rhythm that's promoting that timing. That's probably what's leading to the drastic inconsistencies of the spin efficiency number, right? Start with the hands crossed, same thing, and just go into your throw. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yep. Nice.